interview commencing at 9.47 on the 10th of October 2015. Interviewing is Detective Inspector Frank Kenny. And can I confirm that your name is Christine Carpenter? Yes, that's correct. Here is an easier question for you. Can you confirm that this is your car? For the third time tonight, yes. It belongs to both of us. Sean Fitzpatrick, can you confirm the nature of your relationship with Christine Carpenter? She's my girlfriend. Well, yeah, yeah, I guess she's still my girlfriend. Still? Nah, it's nothing. Look, we're just, we're going through a bit of a rough patch at the moment. You know how it is. How so? Sorry, I don't know how that's relevant. The car which you say you both own was spotted last night fleeing from the scene of a hit and run. A fatal collision that happened at around 1.10 last night. What? Fuck off. How, how is that even possible? Where were you at the time of the incident? We were in the pub all night. Who was keys to your car? We both do. Just the two sets? Maybe somebody broke in? No, we examined the car and there was no evidence of a break in. And the car was found locked. Oh, come on! This is ridiculous! I didn't kill anyone, neither did Sean! Look, we bought it yesterday from this weird fella. Maybe you should ask him. Eugene O'Donnell. Bald lad. Had a big mad face oak on him. Yeah, that's him. That, that's the one. I don't... Look, we heard he had a car. We've been looking for a car for ages. Okay, we got it off him yesterday. He seemed mad keen to get rid of it. It was an absolute heap. I mean, I don't, I don't know how long it had been there for. He said he's tried to get rid of it for ages, but he couldn't. He said it'd kill him. He's had it for years. He didn't accept any money for it either. And as long as he never had to deal with it again, he said he'd be happy. This is a heap of shit. Don't say that. You'll hurt our feelings. Oh, Sean, Sean. What? Sean, the car just started by itself. <laughs> I have the keys in my hand. I don't know, you'll pay a lot of money for that in a new car these days. Come on, just drive, it's fine. Sure, we got it for half nothing anyway. For fuck's sake. Chrissy. I want to take the car back. Look, don't blame it for your shitty driving, okay? Are you fucking joking? I'm no. not staying in this, it's a fucking death no, trap. I'm sorry, look, Chris. Gone, Chrissy, Sean. Chrissy. What? Look. What? Look, can we sleep on it? I don't want to sleep on it. I want you to bring it back I to can't, him. I can't take it back. I can't. So, tell me about your whereabouts last night, exactly. 
We were in the pub all night. I'd been through this before. All night. Was there anyone else there? Uh, Emily. Uh, em Emily Stokes. Anyone else? Jesus. Look, there was loads of people, okay? Plenty of them. Sean was there. Sean? John Fitzpatrick, you are under arrest under the section 1960 of 1961, Road Traffic Act. Anti-UCA can and will be used against you in a court of law. It was the car. It wasn't me, okay? It was the car. But I have my Save it. It wasn't me, it was the car. Do you hear what I'm saying to you? It was the fucking car! It wasn't me, okay? It was the car! It wasn't me! It wasn't! I'm sorry. You can't take me away for something I didn't do. It was, it was a car, okay? You have to listen to my story. It wasn't me, it was a car. It was a fucking car! It wasn't me! It wasn't me! Will you listen to me? Please come back! Please! It's a fucking car!